So in the first movie, you've been working on all of them. Mm -hmm. We had Lika Lekvist. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm from Sweden, so. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And uh, in the second, we had Peter Stormare. Mm -hmm. In the fourth, Bill Skarsgård. But no Swedes in the third movie. That's a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. More Swedes. No, we're very close to uh, a manager named Shelley Browning, um, who manages every Swede working in Hollywood. Yeah. All the stars guards, uh, Daniel Espinoza. Um, Tarek Saleh. Was Tarek Saleh. Yeah. Yeah. Forrest Forrest. Yeah, yeah, that's who we with worked him. with. Yeah. I, I don't know why we didn't have any Swedes in that movie. They're our good luck charms. We are, we're, in, we're doing a movie now that's coming out that you're going to love called uh, Silent Night that John Woo directed. Mm. Uh, there's not one line of dialogue in the entire movie. Whoa. That's uh, cool. And Joel Kinnaman is a yes. fellow Swede, is, is in it? We've made a couple movies with Joel, yes. so. Oh, great. I'm glad to hear. Maybe uh, we need a continental in Stockholm. I think that's oh. probably the way to make it right <laughs> for you. <laughs> that would be the dream. <laughs> <laughs> But, but do you have a, a specific memory with uh, Mikkel you could share? I mean, I just always, I remember shooting the day, you know, he has this iconic line, right? It's like um, when early on in the movies when he, you know, Alfie, his son, has gotten in trouble and uh, he gets the phone call mm. and it's like, you fucked with the wrong guy. And Michael just says, oh. And it's such an iconic moment in the movies, and I think it's a, it's a it's a moment in the film where audiences realize what kind of movie they're in. And I think I remember shooting it that day, and and he was obviously such a he was a, such a great character and a great guy, and so we miss him terribly. And it was I, a great experience. I, he he was tough. Mm -hmm. um, there was an accident on set, um, and he cut his head, like like it was brutal the scar and cut on his head, um, and we thought okay the movie's over we're not going to be able to continue with him. And he's, he's, we sent him to the hospital, he stood himself up, and then just wore a hat for the rest of the movie. And it was brutal. <laughs> it was concussed. It was concussed. Yeah. And, 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 and then I remember we were talking to him at the end going, we're going to figure out the fight between John Wick and, and Michael, you know, Keanu and Michael Nyquist. Um, because Michael Nyquist is much older, not in mm -hmm. good shape. And Keanu Reeves is John Wick's John Wick. He actually thought we were talking about we have to make it f more fair for for Keanu and John Wick. Put it by the end because he because he was like I'm I'm tough. I can take a punch. I can do anything. I, it, so that last scene, it's these two guys boxing, and it's it's surreal when you think of who John Wick turned into over four movies. At the end of the first movie, just those two guys beating the crap out of each other on the Brooklyn Naval Yard. 